Hey guys, this is James from Altel Tech Support here with another tech tip video on the G-Box using the IM608. When you're working with Mercedes-Benz, either you could do it within the car or on the bench. Today, we're going to use it on bench using the W207. In order to achieve this, please select Mercedes and then go into expert mode. From here, go to password calculation. The beauty part about the G-Box, it does the password calculation even faster. So what we're going to do is we're going to select all keys lost fast. This is some diagrams or explanations on each of the EISs. So just hit OK. And here you just select on bench. Then go ahead and select the EIS you're working with. Today, we're working with the W207. The beauty part about the 608, it gives you the diagram on how to select it. For quickness in the video, we went ahead and did it already. So we actually connected all the wires together. Please note that each Mercedes is different. That's why it's a W207 on EISs. So please make sure you follow the corresponding schematic for that EIS. Once you set it up on the bench, please go ahead and connect your XP400 with the APB 102 to the tablet. Also, you want to connect your J-Box to one end of the G-Box. In order to get power, we're going to have to borrow the AC adapter from the IM608. Please allow a few moments for your tool to connect to the J-Box. Once you hear that beep, you're about ready to go. Please follow the directions exactly the way the IM608 prescribes them. Make sure you connect the APB 102 directly into your EIS. And then hit begin. Currently, it's looking at the EIS as well as the actual G box. Now it's asking us to take the APP 102 out, the simulator, and put it right back in. Once you've done this, you'll see this screen up here, and just let it sit there and calculate the password. Note, for the W207, it can take between 10 and 50 minutes. Other ones may take shorter, but we have to allow it some time. While this is happening, just go ahead and walk away and do something else with your car and come back. Okay, our password seems to be calculated. So the next thing we're going to go ahead and do is hit OK. And then OK again. Go back to the main screen here. And select Generate Key File. Hit OK. Make sure you always use the last slots in order to program your key. In this particular case, our last slot to program a key is number six, but yours may be a little different. After that, you hit OK. For our particular key, it's going to be the V51 Half Smart. And then hit OK on that. And it's generating the key file. So now we're all set. The next thing we're going to have to do is write our key. So you're going to put this into the XP400. Go back to the main screen, select read and write key through IR, and write BE key file. The next thing you want to do is select where you made the key file from. And that's it. The 608 will send the information over to the XP400 and our key file is complete. We just made a new key for this Mercedes-Benz towards this EIS. Thank you so much. 
For further tech support, please make sure you call 1-855-288-3587. Take care.